Spud likes to uh, roll with a segment called Head Wobblers, where he basically outs anyone in football who he thinks got him ahead of himself a bit. And one of his major targets is a man called Daryl Timms, who I think we all know, Gary Lyons here, as is Damien Barrett uh, alongside Spud, I think we all know that Timsy is actually a decent bloke. Very good guy. Very, very good professional journalist from done, way back. Done, done the hard yards. Good yards and hard yards and, and honest yards over his journey as a print journalist. For those that don't know who he is, he's got a questionable a Herald, life. Herald Sun columnist. Yes. Does the daily uh, con- confidential, confidential. confidential page and has been a writer for the papers for how long, Warrior? He'd be there for 30 years. 30 about years. At the, at the, decent, the upstanding, honourable man. Well, maybe not honourable, but All right, decent. not honourable. Spud has taken an intense dislike to this man. And I think it's purely on the basis of his haircut. It is, and that's all I know is haircut. I wouldn't know what his name is. And the, the, Why doesn't he do the article on his own? That uh, Chris De Kripney, whatever his name is. De Kretzer. Who? Chris De Kretzer. He does it with him as well. Like, seriously, get a life instead of trying to... <laughs> Listen to us on the airwaves, and a little titbit there, a titbit there. Well, that's the well, nature of the column. That's, that's what the what nature of the column. That's what yeah, well, about. I like it. <laughs> last week, Spud, you gave him a special pasting <laughs> where you basically likened him to uh, the dag on a sheep's yep. ass, and you said that when they appear, you crutch them. You do, you crutch them. You get rid of them. And you sweep them away. <laughs> well, he didn't like it, Timsy. And during, I've been a whale week. Well, you have, and therefore you've missed the rush hour. But during the week... We've got an answering service that the highest people in the land have got access to, and they often just ring and leave a message for whatever reason. And uh, this week we were amazed, I think it was Wednesday when we came in, or Tuesday it might have been, and there was a, a, an answering machine message from Timsy. Have a listen. Uh, JB and Billy, it's Timsy here. Look, I just had enough of Buddy Spud. He's been going around <laughs> bagging me everywhere about my hair, and it's not funny anymore. I can't believe it when he bags people about the size of their heads, like poor Brad Ottens and Brad Ebert. What about the size of his mangled bloody melon? Finn Inkman wouldn't win a prize at a dog show. He looks like bloody Hoss Cartwright. Look, I know you boys are going around bagging me about using a spirit level to make sure my fringe is straight, but it's not funny anymore. And as Purple will tell you, I'll get you guys one by one. Starting with Spud. Because Spud, nothing but a... Oh, that was the way Timsy finished her off. Strong <laughs> nothing finish. but the old third letter. Strong finish, <laughs> Jim. Spud. So, Spud, you've got him wound up. Well, it's, I, I, I told you it was personal. You didn't believe <laughs> oh, me. But didn't now, believe that's you. the first time I've heard that. And for him to... Uh, Cast those as hey, Fair at enough, Spud, because it's, it's, you have given him uh, plenty, and he's, that's his first shot back. It's tools down, mate. Oh. In the bush, uh, she's tools down. You just stop work, Damo, and then you just turn into a, a thrashing machine. One warning, though, with Timsy. Yeah. He, he gets ugly when he's uh, on the back foot. Yep. And he, as I said to JB and, and Billy on the rush hour. How can he week, get ugly? He's one of those guys, if in a, in a boxing match, he'd go, the first punch would be below the belt. Yeah, well, That's his starting it point, and it physical. gets worse from it there. Be, no, if it gets physical, Dave, I don't care what no, the haircut brings to the table. You know table. what I'll do? going to make a mess of him. <laughs> yeah, it's a fair point. <laughs> but I don't know why he's, why is he said he's going to take us down one by well, one. I don't know. He's putting the rest he's of brought, us in yeah, there. Yeah, Gaz, yeah. what's he done to you? He's up haircut. I've been a great supporter over the journey. I can turn pretty quick. I'll tell you what, I... No, I've loved haircut.